All right, what's up guys? Thotherman Gaming here with another test hands video. Uh, today we're gonna be showing off a new brew of mine, uh, the Thigrion, Thigrion's here lament. I think the two archetypes really do have synergy together, being that Thigrion's are live in the grave um, and your tier laments mill stuff to grave, right? So here we're gonna be doing some test hands to kind of like see how, how the deck's looking, see if we need to make some changes. And then we'll come up with a deck profile in a couple days. So starting off, we have oh baby. So here's the deal about this deck. We also play like long. Um, we have room for nine, what you call it, flex spots. So we play the infinites and the super polys, and I believe uh, the droplets because we want to be sending Thurion stuff to grave, right? Um, here, the <laughs> the root is clear, right? We're gonna use Insta Fusion. <laughs> We're gonna get Kit Kalos. Um, okay, Kalos is going to be Ghana Envy, so we're just going to go ahead and add the Merlin, <laughs> uh, because we're going to mill. Uh, and potentially, if we mill two Therion names and Endless Aggro System here, we're in business, um, and I'll, you'll see why. So now, kick Kalos Effect, right, uh, target himself, send himself to Grave, special the Merlin. Now you do chain one, mill five, chain two, mill three. Make sure you protect your mill five, right, in case they want to ash one of these. Oh, baby. Okay. Oh baby, oh baby. And then, okay. So we did get the aggro system, but it's not live right now. And we got ourselves one, two, um, potentially with Rhino three, but we're just gonna use the um, Shireen and the Havness oh, and then the add the add with Soviac. So we'll add with Soviac. So do with chain one Ty Shireen, chain two Havness, chain three add with Soviac. So here you wanna usually typically be adding your Havness. Uh, to have like more interruptions through dark ruler and shit um although we have plenty already but then you're gonna do have resolve happiness right we'll do happiness rhino heart and then really um so you'll place these three at the bottom of your deck right to resolve we we'll get out the the kaleido heart then from here you'll do so resolve shireen Recycling the Kit Kalos and the Shireen to get Proto Plant. Okay, and now you've resolved your chain. Um, and we end up with all this. So, uh, pretty neat, <laughs> pretty good mill if you ask me. We just didn't get access to the uh, to the Therion cards. So now we'll just go ahead and make sure we set our Soliac. We'll set one Imperm and then we'll set the Super Poly because we'll save one Imperm for discard. So um, here we have one, two, three, four, five, six interruptions potentially because if you send Tier Element name and then you make another Dragos Topelia, six interruptions, not to mention the Havness. Um, could be seven, eight, you know, who knows. So um, yeah, pretty good and board, solid, not bad, right? Pretty much just doing tier stuff. I mean, this is like pure tier shenanigans. <laughs> like, it's insane how far just like a good tier, like, um, chain can take you. So now let's try to see if we can, let's try to see if we can get ourselves, um, some tier, some, uh, theory on action. We might have to up the, uh, theory on count, honestly. It might be looking like an up the tier count kind of thing. Okay. Oh, not bad. Not bad, guys. So here, um, pretty cool. Um, and you'll see why. So here uh, we have the Aqua Therion. We have Lily, which is going to search us the field spell um, for the Therions and get us going there. And we have Shireen to send one of them to the grave. So this is where like some of this energy really comes into place. Shireen can always send a Therion name to make your other Therion in hand live. And you'll see it here. Um, so here we're going to do uh, Shireen effect um, on resolution. I'll summon herself. And then we're going to go ahead and pitch the Lily. Um, we'll pitch the Lily. And then we'll mill, mill three. One, two, three. Oh, perfect. So here we don't even have to, we can use our Merly with the Aqua Turtles to get Kakalos going. So we'll do just that. And then Kakalos effect on summon. Um, here, I'm always adding the Soliac. I'm a big Soliac fan. I think it just gets us so much advantage in the grind game and Gets us that interruption we need through through Dark Ruler. Um, from here, uh, we go ahead and activate Reaper. Uh, targeting Lily. So, and then Lily effect. Or not Lily effect, but Reaper effect. 
the the, the movie of Fikey Gangs. Um, we're gonna search the field spell. We'll activate the Theron field spell, and then that'll notice King Regulus. We'll activate Regulus, summoning, attaching the Lumi. So now, um, now this board might not look like much, but it's actually pretty good. So we'll set the Soliac and then honestly, um, I'll set the Imperm. I'll keep the Poly in hand. I don't think it's going to be necessary. Um, uh, although sometimes, I mean, you might want to, depends on your playing, you might want to set the Super Poly, keep the Imperm in hand. But, um, that's flexible. Anyways, here, so we, here we have the Soliac Negate. Um, we have... Um, then we have Mill 5 off Kit Kahlo setting her to fuse. Um, or you can always just send the Shireen and then fuse with the Kit Kalos, making that Dracos Dupelia. So this is honestly guaranteed and a guaranteed two negates, one off itself, two off the setting the Shireen and making the Dragos Dupelia. Um, you have a negate with regular, so that's three. You have Reaper, a bounce, so four interruptions. And a bounce being you can bounce back Lily to your hand, or typically just want to bounce back the Theory on Field spell. Um to get like an activation next turn um so yeah pretty cool um honestly you might want to keep the theory on field spell up just to get its benefits protecting from battle sending aggro system to keep your engine going so you can also with the reaper uh target lily target opponent's monster bounce this back to your hand Lily's follow up right and then just use regulus um effect by sending itself or the reaper to grave probably the reaper to grave um because here you can like get free fusion um with being an aqua engraved as well so yeah pretty cool uh not bad kind of shows off what um a possible theory on and board can look like um honestly the theory on cards are so good and i think like just like you need something to enable them um and i think like previous formats obviously it was the punk with like the mill eight with the chaos ruler plus zombie vampire oh, sorry that was mill nine but now here we have like the mill like eight potentially 11 with shireen and kit kalos to enable them as well so let's see another test hand okay so we have theory on shenanigans Ooh, we have both engines going here so here we're gonna fish uh activate aggro system here you want to be sending the lily to grave and then from here now that we have lily in grave um we're gonna activate disco coliseum or disc coliseum i call it disco but here we add the Omni Negate to hand, which is gonna become two negates actually, and you'll see why. So we're gonna activate Regulus, targeting the Lily. Assuming it goes through, it gets equipped. We activate Regulus effect, the effect he gains off Lily, pitching Lily to add ourselves to the cross. So now we have a Monster Negate and Banish because we have Aggro System Engraved and we have the Omni Negate with Regulus. So um, there you go. That's two interruptions just off our two uh, little, little Theoran engine. And now we can go ahead and proceed to do Trail Dimension shenanigans. So we're normal summon the Reino Heart. We'll activate Reino Heart effect, sending the Havness. Um, Havness will trigger. Here, um, we'll do Reino Heart and Havness um, to get the Kit Kalos. Kit Kalos effect. Um, here we just search the Havness that we just put at the bottom of the deck um, to have Soliac through hand trap through uh, Dark Ruler and Havness through Dark Ruler. Not to mention already crossed through Dark Ruler. Um, then we'll activate Kakalis effect, targeting herself. Get Merlin to Mel 8. Fail great. Uh, so we've only used okay, we got another fusion coming. Ooh, baby, we got effects coming. Okay. So we've only used the Havness. Okay, and we got more aggro system. Great, that's great. Um so here now we can do Shireen effect engrave. Um, fusing with the Rhino Heart and the Havness. And that'll get us the Kaleido Heart. And this is like, you get a guaranteed Celiac off because this guy can't be like super poly, right? So now this is your end board. Um, again, you have Omni Negate, you have a Negate and Banish. I'm um, going to use this first. You have a Negate, so that's three interruptions. You have Response, which is potentially four interruptions. And then five interruptions. And you have field spell theory on up, so like it protects you from battle, sending like theory on to grave follow-up. And then on the next turn, like you activate aggro system, and then you can add back the Lily. Or you can like assuming you use Regulus, um, you can add back the Regulus too to your hand. So fault theory on amazing theory on follow-up, amazing two element setup. And that's the board. 
whatnot. So pretty good. All right, guys, that's about 10 minutes. So uh, I'm going to do one more test hand. I don't want the video to run too much longer. Let's see what kind of heat we uh, garner here. And again, like, um, deck is looking pretty nice. I'm going to be testing out with some friends today and uh, posting some uh, updated deck profile after I kind of make the necessary changes I feel that are necessary. So here we're going to activate planet. Um, again, grabbing the Shireen because we want to mill. <laughs> We want to mill, guys. We want to get our Therion engine going. We see we already have one Therion in hand. We just need one more to get the engine rolling in Grave. Okay, so here we're activating Shireen. Effect, sending the Havness, no three. One, two, three. Okay, perfect. Um, here we're going to do chain one Havness, chain two Soliac. Soliac is going to add us the Merly. And then Havness is going to fuse with this one on field, making Kit Kalos. Kit Kalos is gonna go ahead and yield us the trap card. We place two Ciliac because it's never bad to see in hand, never bad to mill, obviously. Now from here, we're gonna continue our quest for mills. Uh, Kit Kalos targeting herself, special the Merly. Chain one, Kit Kalos, mill five. Chain two, Merly, mill three. So we're milling eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we already used Havness, but now we can go ahead and proc uh, Shireen, Shireen effect. Uh, here, we can do Shireen and you know what? Um, yeah, we could do Shireen and Kid Kalos. Okay, we'll see, we'll, we'll see something interesting here. Um, and we're gonna make the Dragos Topelia, which actually isn't gonna stay on our board for too long. Um, now we'll do Dragos Topelia and Merly to make ourselves Sprite Elf. Um, and you may be asking, why the heck did you do that, man? Well, now Lily's live, because Lily target Dragos Topelia to summon. Um, Lily effect, sending the Dragos Topelia to get ourselves the theory on field spell. Now we'll go ahead and activate Sprite Elf, targeting the Merly um, to summon. Oh, the Merly is gonna go ahead. Oh, not Mill because we already did that, but we're gonna hang in and set up our IP. And then from here, we're gonna go ahead. Um, you can actually chill here. Um, this is actually pretty good. Um, by itself, and you just have theory on Disco Coliseum for follow up. But if you want to do the full shenanigans, you activate Disco Coliseum, um, adding us the Regulus, Regulus target, Bluey, and then bam, we have an Omni Negate, we have IP which can make Underworld Goddess or Nightmare Unicorn. Um, those are my choices. Sprite Elf is going to revive the Merly Mill 3. Sully is going to use the Merly or the Happiness to F negate and fuse. Um, Happiness is going to mill 3. So pretty solid. Pretty solid. And we for sure have OTK on the clapback. Because um, granted our Therions go to Grave. Um, we have English Aggro System in Grave to recycle them. Um, another way you could have done this too. Is instead of search the Therion field spell. Um, you could have actually left Lily on field. Um, I'll just backtrack real quick. And then just get the cross. Um, and this just, you won't have Regulus access. You'll have the cross and you won't have IP. Um, so what this does is that you're not super polyable. Um, you have a negate and banish. You have a negate, granted you revive them early or summon the Havness. And then you have, you know, potentially more to come. So this is actually like, I guess more resilient through Dark Ruler because um, you have the game banish. Um, so pretty cool. Oh, pretty cool, guys. Uh, well, that's it for this video. Um, it's coming up to 15 minutes. So that's like the sweet spot I want to hit between 10 and 15. Um, if you like the video, um, please you know, leave, drop a like, drop a subscription. Uh, if you want to see the deck profile, let me know below. If you have any thoughts on the deck, comments, let me know below. I appreciate you guys watching. Have a great one. Happy Monday. Happy start to your week, guys. Take care. Peace.